Hey guys, so this is Eric Wu here, and I'm currently finishing up my uh, fieldwork semester at the Dr. Paul Sean Center at the University of Regina. For my special project, I decided to develop a testing protocol binder that has all the tests, now the DPSC, CEPs, uh, trainers of the varsity teams can look through um, so they can review the protocols before they do their test. So the purpose of this project is to develop a organized uh, binder that has all the testing protocols for uh, different testers to use on different uh, populations. Um, organizing this testing protocol binder will make the test uh, more valid and hopefully more reliable when the testers are doing them so that uh, if a different tester may come along and do a test, it'll make it still uh, Pretty much the same as when the other tester did it. So when I was uh, developing this uh, testing protocol binder, I looked through different protocols uh, that are used for athletes here at the university. Um, so I decided to add norms onto some tests uh, that are used uh, in this protocol so that it is easier for the tester to uh, interpret how the score uh, uh, compared to other uh, different teams or different leagues. Another valuable thing that I gained uh, from developing this binder is that this uh, binder itself kind of sums up um, what I did during my field work and uh, how much I've learned and how, um, I've, how I've become uh, became good at doing different assessments, uh, tests on uh, different population as well. It's a valuable thing that I found uh, during when I was developing this testing uh, protocol binder is that it sums up uh, what I did during my fieldwork semester here at the Dr. Paul Schwank Center. As an uh, entry level exercise uh, professional, I uh, in the future I can refer back to this testing protocol binder and see what I did um, when I was here doing my fieldwork, and also I can add. I can uh, make a binder for myself to see um, how many more different testing protocols uh, I would I could learn in the future, and would uh, also refer back uh, to these protocols if I had any questions about them.